inside the British Museum today and it is so beautiful. We're in the Greek part of the museum and this is statues and things from the Parthenon. So we were just in King's Cross Station and Chelsea's here. Hello. <laughs> and we just successfully um, went through the, what is it, the platform? <laughs> we got our scarves and uh, we had an owl. And it was, it was all it's good. It was very fluffy. Yeah. It was very fluffy. And now we're, uh, now we're ready to go get some high tea. Mm. There is no service on the Northern Line. Baker Street, Baker Street's the best, uh, the next one, yeah. Where's Abbey Road? It's on the side, where's my house? Uh, okay. This is Baker Street. This is yeah. Baker Street. People keep trying to get pictures of how the Beatles did it, but there's so much traffic. <laughs> this is what we end up doing to traffic. Oh, this was their, oh, I see. This is their recording studio. I see. So bad news is you have to pay like 30 pounds to get up to the top of the shark. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're not going to do that. So bad news, we're going to go to eat dinner. Mm, dinner's good. Food. Yes. Food is good. Mediterranean food. <laughs> it's going to be delicious. <laughs> Hi guys, so I realized that today when I was filming I didn't, I didn't really talk much about what we did so I thought I would just quickly recap. We started off and we went to the British Museum which was absolutely amazing. Um, there's so much history, stolen history, um, from Egypt and from Greece and Rome. Um, uh, basically anywhere around the world there's history from the British Museum and it was just so cool that we got to go see it. Then we went to... Toronto, what do we do after the British Museum? We went to King's Cross. Ah, thank you. So then we went to King's Cross and we waited in line so that we could pretend to be going through the barrier, which was lovely. Um, that was funny. Went, oh, then we went to Abbey Road uh, where the Beatles were, where their album cover was, and we nearly got run over about three different times trying to get the picture taken. Um, and a bunch of other tourists were there too, and they nearly got run over as well. So you know, everyone was just having a... The London drivers were like on their horns. They were so mad that people were trying to take these pictures. So we went to high tea, which was, you know, very British, very proper. Uh, um, we put our elbows on the table by accident. Um, pinkies up? Yep, yep, pinkies up. Chelsea did that right. She had her pinky up the whole time. I like London a lot. I really do. It's, and people are actually really friendly here, which also surprised me because I was always told that the British are very um, rude and short and, well, not rude, but just like very curt. Um, and I've been obviously in Ireland for the past couple of months, um, but everyone in London is very nice and everyone's just very friendly. Oh, we went to a Mediterranean restaurant uh, and we went to uh, what was it called? Tar, Tras, Tas. We went to Tas, and it was delicious. It was Turkish food. I tried um, dolmas, which which Tirana and Fiona apparently love. But it's like rice wrapped in a bunch of leaves. Like, I kid you not, leaves. Fig leaves? Grape. Grape leaves. And it just felt like I was a five-year-old who was like making their own food out of like what they found. People have different palates and that's all great, but I thought, I thought, I was just felt like I was eating leaves, so I was not a fan of those. But the rest of the food was really good. And it was just a nice restaurant. Um, what else? Oh, London is really expensive. Like, everyone told me that coming over here, but now... I know it. Except this morning I managed to find yogurt, a banana, a croissant, and orange juice all for, I think I got that all for three pounds. Which is not bad. How many dollars is that? Like five? Yeah. Five dollars? <laughs> not, not too bad. Not too bad at all. See you guys later. Goodbye!